Hello everybody, and welcome back to some more Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. We're gonna go in the snow until we get the last crystal star. We should heal though. Really? Do we need heal? I don't, I don't believe you. That's a great idea, Cameron. You're just, you're just full of bright ideas. Uh. You're just a little guy. Oh, I guess we'll go heal first. We can go into this thing that we never really go into. For healing. Well, actually, it cost like a dollar. This dude's been up here for so long. Yeah, I mean, he's waiting for Princess Peace to come back. Oh, we got an egg coupon. It's free. I forgot we had. I didn't even get the get the toad annoying voice. Like, <laughs> Do we get a peachy peach? No. Nope. Instead, we just get arthritis. We got syphilis. Let's go! <laughs> yes! Score! You unlocked a new DLC in life. Syphilis. Yay! <laughs> oh, shit, this DLC is not free. <laughs> there, oh, shit. What was the thing that I saw? I was watching this dude, right? And he was doing, like, these confession things. Where he's, like, like, um... So, people submit their confessions. And the guy reads and he goes like, what the fuck? So anyway, there was one where the, this girl found out his, her boyfriend was cheating on her. Mainly because she's like, that's the only guy that she sleeps with. And like, she got like, gonorrhea and whatnot. And so she was able to get it treated. She's, she's good now. But uh, she never told the guy. And he doesn't believe in doctors. So there's probably a, a good chance that he still has gonorrhea. That is disgusting. Yeah. That is not exactly what I wanted to hear in my Super Paper Mario playthrough. <laughs> hey look! Two minutes in and we're talking about STDs. I love how now it's giving you the thing saying, okay. oh yeah, chapter, chapter start or whatever. seven! Even though you've already gone through this pipe once before. Mario shoots the moon! <laughs> I piss on the moon! I wonder what would have happened if you like actually tried to make any progress before the chapter started. I guess we can find out now. Maybe there's uh, like some kind of roadblock. Well, now we don't have the little cutscene. It's like, man, this place is cold. There, there was probably like a little thing to stop us from probably going further. Yeah, that would have been kind of, kind of silly. Yeah. Kind of goofy. <laughs> kind of bonkers, if you will. Quirky, if you insist. Oh, look at that guy. <laughs> Yeah, I, I looked at him all right. Wait, I saw something. Yeah, it's a shine spray. Is that a shine spray? Yeah, behind the, behind the... No, it's like right behind this tree, you have to jump. There you go. Ah! Yeah, scary! See, I, piece. I know this game <laughs> better than even you do. Yeah. We'll, get, we'll get my incredible dodging skills. I was so hoping he would just come up right before the exit. <laughs> All right, Yoshi, you know what to do. Now I'll get to actually see what this attack does. Stop. Go, Yoshi's! Oh my god. Did it come around here? Oh, I thought that would kill them. What can I- what can I do? These things are tanky. Yeah, I mean, this is like, the last, like, main chapter area. What?! You're a whore! <laughs> and not in a good way. No, I'm a whore. Yes, you are. <laughs> shit. I can do this. You could not do it. Wait, I was gonna say just normal hammer. Yeah. Probably good enough. You're doing a little dancey dance. I need to get you one of those like uh, mic stands for your microphone. Yeah. You know, we can use one of the cool ones that those streamers have, where it like hangs above. Yeah, I mean that's like what the I was... podcaster. Thing. Go away. 
I got eight. Uh-oh. Nice. Uh-oh. No! Mario, stop! <laughs> he said, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Wait, that's what power jump looks like? Why does it look like that? I don't know. There's little spike things. Does that mean I can jump on these? Welcome to Factor Cap! <laughs> no! Hold on. Yay! I thought that's what I meant. I mean, there is a badge somewhere that lets you jump on spiky enemies somewhere. But I don't think we've gotten that yet. Mario, you suck. Maybe I just suck. <laughs> Am I the problem? Did I just do a super? Yeah. That man is dead! And then... No, nah, because Stampede won't hit that one. This is just a goal. Open these nuts. Wait, it didn't want to hit the other guy? He's kind of rude. Wait, before before you beat this thing up, what? What, if, what if you did Sweet Feast? We've never actually seen that one before. Yeah, let's do it! Restore Mario's and Allies HP and FP and cure poison. Hold blah left and try to hit hearts and stars. Hearts and flowers. Wait, is it just a better sweet treat? Yeah. Oh, good! Yeah, so it's just a better sweet treat. We really get more. Yo, this is amazing! Yeah. yeah, it's just a better sweet treat. Alright, ground pound that thing. <laughs> Dang, how much fun do you treat this bitch have? I think you just need to jump on it one more time. Shit. That's it. Kill that motherfucker. Just jump in the crowd and murder the daisy. <laughs> there you go. Oh, this thing has 5% juice. That means it's healthy. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was safe on the block. Oh. You weren't safe the first time. Oh, shit. No, because I jumped on him on purpose, because I thought that worked. Alright, stampede this thing. You think you can do it? <laughs> you have to do it in alternate order. I did it in an alternate order. Okay, I got a good from that, that's fine. What does that do? Stop hitting me! That's rude! I'm gonna let you actually go on the front now. <laughs> there you go, buddy. Should I try Stampede again? Sure. Okay. There you go. I'm pretty sure it was only registering you pressing like R or L. Damn. Wait, is that a level up? It is. <laughs> Perfect. We need a bit. <laughs> what was it? M, M HP this time, right? Yes. We just got that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, give me the fuck points. I need to buy the next copy of Super Luigi. <laughs> you know, Super Paper Luigi. Oh, oh. Look at this area, so pretty. Bar outpost. Are you ready to butcher several accents? Offend a whole entire population? Yeah. Well, Bar outpost. Where's this cannon that's supposed to shoot to the moon? Let's shout out some of these locals and see what they have to say, okay? Yeah. Hold on, I saw a, a thing. Thank you. Welcome. Well Welcome to Far Outpost. Whoa, that is quite good lip warmer you've got. Okay, I now give you my special mustache viewing personality analysis, huh? 
Ah, hmm. Ah, ah, hmm. Ah, ah, I've got it now. Your bushy brow means that you are a stubborn and selfish man. Kill yourself. <laughs> so how did I do? No, do not protest. I know. No one likes to admit their faults. Thanks, bitch. This is Babum Village. Babuli. There is nothing here. Babuma. I feel like there's a star thing around here. Alright. No, it's the Traveling Sisters! Snow is rare to you, Dakuk. After you are not very good at reading these. No. You said Dakuk? Well, it's not a real word. <laughs> it's Bakak. <laughs> of course you would know how to say that. Far outpost. It falls all year round. I like watching it shining and glow if. I like watching it shine in glow of sunset. Okay, I didn't. Ba boomer. Ba boomer. Boom, basta boom, basta boom. <laughs> Hello, traveler. First time in Far Outpost, Gabluri. What? Far Outpost Cannon? Ah, oh, I apologize for that. No, I just had distraction. It is nothing. Kapui. Hi. We're the Chili Wanderers, the Traveling Sisters 3. We came to Far Outpost for skiing and ice skating, but there's nothing here! It's cold! It's too cold! I told you we should have at least checked the guidebook before we came here! Ooh. Where do these bitches live? Where's their homes? Where's this guy? I made big snow bomb today. Maybe I make big as him someday. <laughs> but I don't want to be melting what to happen to me. A boom. A boom. <gasps> it's this dude! Boombala! <laughs> wow, so they have a they have the French dude in in the Russian area. Ah, oh, must read their mustache. I have tried so many times to talk to the girl in this inn, but she kicked me out. So now I must use what? I must use the the what? Is the he... eat of my feelings for you to melt the snow. Oh, the heat! Yeah. Yay! <laughs> you did that by accident, didn't you? No, I saw it. Oh, look at her. No. <laughs> nah. We're good. Mm -hmm. Wow, he didn't even acknowledge you, Bella. Wait. You had a hint, this guy. To come out to you in this forsaken place. Talk about totally tenacious. This dude is serious. Yep. Seriously fucking ugly! <laughs> Seriously get some bitches! This guy. It's the shop. Oh, it's in the shop. I got items. Sooty star. I got some- we need some of these for our stupidity. I need to take my phone off the desk because that picks up on the mic. Who is texting me? <laughs> okay, it was just my dad. <laughs> my dad! <laughs> Yo, is this it? Hmm, I don't know. I mean, it's they've, been, cannon. they've been talking about a cannon. I wonder if that cannon is it. Duh. What business do you have here? What? A cannon? No such thing here. What? You're crazy, man. There's gotta be a cannon around here somewhere. What do you want me to say? We do not have one. What? There's fucking one right here, you piece what of shit. What about this giant fucking cannon <laughs> that's behind us? I know nothing, Shabui. I know nothing about big bomb cannon. Shashoom. Man, you guys are bitches around here. It is so peaceful. Wahoo! Far outpost is nice. Restful place. Wahoo! <laughs> what do you have to say for yourself? Looking at the night sky makes me feel vastness of space. Lots of space, Baboom. Just like the cannon that definitely is not here. <laughs> yeah, just like a cannon that I definitely do not know about. What is cannon? <laughs> I do not know how to spell cannon, nor know how to say tannin. In fact, I don't even know who I am. Where what am, am I? I? What am I? <laughs> Why am I? <laughs> Can we talk to him again? What? Did I not tell you we have no silly cannon? Well, what do we do now? Gumbella? Do you have any? Oh shit. You're not Gumbella, you're a Yoshi. This is part of Far Outpost. There's a shop and an in here, so that's something. They have a huge cannon like monument over there, too. Very bomb-offish. What's this over here? Oh, 
Just actually jack shit. Okay. Well, what do we do now? Fuck you. Piece of shit. Wait, 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 wait. I have an idea. What if you got bomber yet? Oh, that's right. That's right, I get this star piece. Yeah, he'll probably talk to the bomb. Yeah, that's a little racist. <laughs> what? Did I tell you I have no city cannon? Now nah, listen here, you're the mayor, hmm? How can an official like you lie that way? Oh boy, I know I saw a cannon the last time I was here, so do not lie, sir. You call yourself a bomb, I spit at you. <laughs> you know rules. There is n no to be no mention of cannon to number bombs. No mention. We must not allow it to be used for evil. Of course I know all that, you great blowhard. But we must use that cannon to get to the moon, old boy. And if we don't, sir, the world could end. Hmm. Ah. Uh, world could end. Um. Well, we cannot have that now. Still, I, you cannot use cannon right now because of certain circumstances. Circumstances? We must have permission from Gobobom to use cannon. He's the one who started this whole blasting things into faraway places policy. Once he got rich, he left business business side and does not start it up again. Also, General White was the one who devoted himself to operation of cannon. But he is so depressed by losing of job that he took cannon key and left. Gold Bob and General White? Da, that is correct. If you want to use cannon, you have to find Gobobomb and General White. Very well then. We can't give up now, old boy. Mario, let's go find those two. Well, once you find them, come back and talk to me. Alright. Let's get going then. Well, we know where Gobobomb is. That's that rich dude. Yeah. And then we saw where General White was. It was like way back at the beginning of the game. In Petalburg, remember? Oh, is that where he is? Yeah, I remember that, like, the- Maybe the that's why you're allowed to unlock the, <laughs> the things that allow you to, like, quick teleport around. Yeah. Yeah, because remember there was a, a bomb with a white hat. Hmm. Yeah. Check, check this shit out. <laughs> Dude, I, I wasn't even scared. Alright, well, well, I guess we'll head to... Yeah, I need a new one. Why don't I... <laughs> we can get one of those water bottles I keep seeing from uh, sponsored uh, YouTube videos. Hashtag not sponsored, yeah. by the way. Uh, it's like Arabub? Arab. That's the... <laughs> That's the name of the business, where like, it's a water bottle. And then you, they have a little, like, pod scents that, like, it, it only adds scent to your mouth. So it's like you're tasting through your mouth. So, you might think it has a taste of orange, but in reality, you're still drinking plain water. Hmm. It's scent-based What, scent -based if, the, what if the scent is dog food? I don't know. I, I mean, they're all fruit-based, so I don't think there's one no. that could be shit, you know? What if, what if, what if it's fruit... fruit shit? I don't know where I'm going <laughs> with this. Okay, are you mentally okay? <laughs> no. Oh, that makes sense. Alright, I guess we'll do Poshley Heights first, and then we'll go to Petalburg. He just... Oh! My aunt's plane arrives around like 1.45. Yeah, that's perfect timing, so what's- oh shit. <laughs> so once I get done hanging out with Jolene, I can go over and see my aunt! Yeah. Yeah, I can't wait to see her. I should visit more often. But she's all the way up in New Jersey, so... A little bit inconvenient. Yeah. No, so there's really nothing there that I, like, besides her. Also, it's like eight hours, because I don't want to... You never... can't even fill your own gas there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're right. You can't do that. Yeah. I forgot. It's still one of the only states that you can't pump your own gas. I guess you're incompetent of <laughs> Yeah. There's another state still like that. Isn't it, like, um... Washington State? Or the one below it? Oregon, right? I don't know. I know you could do like crack on the street in Oregon. Yeah. 
I know in New in New Jersey, uh, their property tax is like absolute dog. Oh, this wrong place. Their their property tax is absolute dog shit and whatnot, like overpriced as fuck. But like they don't tax you on food and clothes when you buy them. Pretty sure this one's Pelberg. Yeah, this one's Pelberg. Yeah, because the two starting areas are next to one another. But um. Yeah, so when we went up there, it was like a, like right before when I went back to school for like stuff. So we just got her like clothes there. Where was he? I think it was over here, right? Nope. Mm. <laughs> no, he was up here, right? Is he the one that has Princess Peach all in his? No, no, no this was the different house. Oh. Well. Yeah, he was up when he around here when we uh, last saw him. Oh, uh, yep. Cool. Hmm. Oh shit! Don't bitch, get off of it! <laughs> Yay! Yay! All right, who would know where this babam is? So it's definitely not the pink one, because that's the mayor's house. Yeah. This is Coops and and uh and our, our boy our boy's dad's house. Yeah. That's I mean it's technically still dude. his house, yeah. Actually they're from the first Oh he was right here, right? That's the uh -huh. that's the person who like loved Peach. What about Yes, I defeat a hotel. Yeah, praise me, everyone. You know what it is? No? Can I check inside this house? Sure. Where is this bitch at? Yeah. Are we supposed to do, b like, gold bomb first? If so, that's a little silly. Oh. Huh? What's that? General White. Oh, he was here a while ago, but then he started- He said he was taking a trip and then he left. Wait, hang on a second. He did say something about a deserted island in the south. He was either going there or not going there. I assume he went there. Yeah, so he, he went to Kiyohaki then. Yeah. I think we have a fast travel point for that one Yeah, too. thank god, because I didn't want us to take the midnight train going anywhere. <laughs> Just a small town girl! My hands are fucking sweaty! Shit! Come on, Yoshi! Boing ha or whatever. It's this one, right? Yeah, and then the one right next to it should be. Uh, the, the penguin area. Yeah. Yep. Washi Heights. I wonder if it spawns you in the, the forest and not where the civilization is. I don't know. Do we ask the bomb where the bomb is? <laughs> oh, there are what? Yeah, he was here until a second ago, but he took off real quick. Said he was going to an arena or something. Oh my gosh, he went to the freaking Glizzyville. Yo, Lanzi. <laughs> I guess while we're like the pipes right next to one another, we can go talk to the gold bomb. Uh -huh. Get that taken care of and be like, can we use your can? <laughs> He's gonna be like, I don't care. I'm I'm, I'm too rich to get a shit. <laughs> I need to go buy a train for my son. Yeah. Do you have any contacts with big trains? Yeah. He just buys out the XX Express. <laughs> oh, there's cheap cheeps on the fountain. Oh yeah, he was at the very front. Yeah. Last time we saw him. Yeah, there he is. Hey, buddy. Good day to you, Gonzalez. What can I do for you today? What's that you say? You must use the cannon and far outpost to save the world. Hmm. Well, that is rather a pickle, isn't it? I'll do it for one train. <laughs> very well then. I certainly owe you a favor or two. Hmm. Yes, I should say. The truth is, I had hoped to resume my business with that cannon someday. And just between us, I only stopped because the wife said she didn't like the noise. Oh, damn. Sadly, it takes a hefty bit of coin to get that cannon working, so... 
I'll need you to demonstrate just how much you want to use that cannon. If it were a matter of money, just how much would you pay if I ask? One coin. One coin? Can you mock me? Why not just slap me with your shoe and be done? This will not do, no no. Ah, shit. <laughs> 64? 64 coins! You seem to be underestimating the value of my okay. chances. I don't want to give you 400 well, coins. Well, I just can't abide that. Why don't you come back later? Why don't we just go spend all of our coins and then... Oh my god, that's so genius! And then, and then we can say... Wait, we should say first just in case he, like, doesn't... And then he's like, this is way too fucking loud. Is there even a shop in here? I thought so. Is there- uh, there's a hotel. That's a normal house. That's a hotel. And then we, there's a museum down here. Alright, let's, let's go back to Rogueport and spend some money. No, we should just go ahead. We're really gonna lose 400 coins? That we save. So maybe he's like, oh, you know what? You seem really worthy. You can keep your coins. What if he takes all of our coins? I'll cry. <laughs> what? You pay every coin you own? All of them? You were... Really? Really? Well, I suppose I'm just surprised to hear you say that. Staggered, actually. You know that means you'll be left with zero coins with absolutely nothing? You know that, do you? Yeah. I mean, think of it, man. <laughs> if you spent all your coins, I mean, all of them, you would certainly face a great deal of difficulty down the road. Yeah, I know. But hold on, I want to make sure you're doing this fully aware of the company. <laughs> Are you sure? You won't regret this later, absolutely sure? Yeah. I can really take that off, really? <laughs> Am I supposed to say no? You won't say just kidding later or any on tomfoolery like that. Oh, well, alright then. She actually takes all of your fucking coins. <laughs> Mm, well, you certainly showed me something, sir. So, uh, I give my permission for you to activate the Far Outpost Cannon. Yay! Oh, and I wasn't serious earlier, my dear fellow. How could I take your money? Ha 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 It's a shame, I suppose. But I'll return your money. Okay. See? He's a good guy. Now, soldier on, my boy. Alright! Oh shit. Email! <laughs> Thank you for almost letting me take all your money. That's a rogue work thing, yep. Rogue Port today, an unknown businessman, age 30, was taken into custody today by port authorities as he tried to board the blimp carrying large amounts of a volatile red liquid. After a few tense moments, authorities identified the liquid as a spicy condiment. It was spicy ketchup. <laughs> and the businessman was subsequently released. No, no, no it's fucking Chipotle sauce. <laughs> yeah. Our RDM reporters were mystified by the following unsolicited comment. Why are you hot sauce, folks? Top reporter go. This week we have the pleasure of introducing the fabulously luxurious shop on the Excess Express, the sales stall. The unique boutique on the exclusive train of the independently wealthy just rakes of money. But perhaps the idyllic landscapes rushing past will loosen your purse strings, says the impeccably dressed manager of sales. Come one, come all, be you rich or not at all, to our lovely sales stall. He then announced a double point sale for all RDM readers. Show on the screen in the next 15 minutes to double your points on any purchase. Cooking for rookies. This is it, rookies. We finally made it to the big leagues. Today's recipe is an advanced level one. Today we'll be making ink pasta. Just boil fresh pasta until perfectly al dente and mix lightly with inky sauce. Perfecto! Get ready for gourmet chow tonight. Editor's note. Can you believe it, dear readers? The next issue will be our last. Don't miss it. Published by Report Restoration Committee. Yay! Let's go, Yoshi! Yoshi! Where is he again? Oh. Where's the, um... He's in Glizzyville. The land's <laughs> thing. Is that, like, isn't that, like, the spun like, the Spongebob thing where whoever just goes, the land's thing? Please tell me you know what me I'm talking about. He's like, I bet they won't have... <gasps> Oh my god, they have it! Blizzly! <laughs> no, 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 it's like this. <gasps> they have it! Dan Coochie! <laughs> oh shit! 
do get for not paying attention. Shut up. I know I'm not that rich. I know I'm not that smart. But let me drive my van into your heart. Let me drive my van into your heart. Fucked. You fucked, you bitch. Oh yeah, Glizzy though. I was like, where are we going again? <laughs> well, this is like kind of like revi re revisiting some of our old places. Yeah, and I can't wait for it to tell us to go fuck off to Twilight. <laughs> And he's like, he was trying to feel like depressed or whatever, so he went over there. The wrong one. <laughs> wrong alley. Yo, what up? <laughs> you look weird. Oh, yeah. Oh sorry. Oh sorry. Oh sorry. <laughs> Let me aboard, please. Just I gave him like a concussion with the amount of times I hit him with the hammer. Oh yeah, you like showed him an in coupon, he's like, uh probably close enough, I can't tell. <laughs> uh my vision's a little weird right now. That that is a a blimp ticket, right? And it's like a like an in it's like I shoot just a piece of paper. Is it gonna really do this full ass animation? It better thing? not. Oh my, my god! god. <laughs> I skipped it. <laughs> this bomb mob better fucking be here. It's oh, it's the rat! Place. Or is it a different business rat? Is this a different rat or is it the same rat? Oh, that's not good. No one will solve my problem. Oh, shit. Bum. He's on the board somewhere. We would know. Maybe he'll be at the juice? I'm gonna ask this guy real quick. I feel like there's a star piece around here somewhere. Probably. <gasps> yes! Let's go, bitch! Chips. I love chips. I can get in there. That's the bartender. Oh, he must be in the wipe of bomb, huh? Yeah, he used to come in here all the time. But I haven't seen him lately. Now that I think about it, I think he headed off to some huge tree, or not. Mm. Moving right along, we found the life on the highway. And your way is my way. So trust my nap. Wait a minute, you need a blimp tick to get off this up? Yep. That's kind of... So if you're too poor to get another ticket for it, you're stuck? Yep. Uh, that's why so many people are in the glizzy pit. Yeah. They need to make money so that they can leave. But the only thing that's here is the, the stadium, right? And a couple of shops. There's no homes here. It's a small piece of floating land. <laughs> California, here he come, the high in the sky land. The title of this episode is gonna be Where the Fuck Is That Bomb? The book, the movie. <laughs> Alright, at least we can go back in the sewers and uh, do a little pipe thing. Wait, why don't you just go back to it? That's right. You're so smart. What do I do without you? I don't know. I'm a Goofy Goober! Run! You're a Goofy Goober! We're all Goofy Goobers! Goofy 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 Goober! Well, I wanna watch the Spongebob movie. You wanna watch the Spongebob movie? I wanna watch the, the Spongebob movie where you gotta get the, the crown back for King Neptune and then they're like, BALD! BALD! My eyes! <laughs> yeah. Now that we're in. Yeah, that's where they're like, hey. 
He's like, Philip, please, he's like, what would you prefer? Ketchup or mustard? <laughs> and they get their, like, car stolen. And they ride that dude on the way back after they get the crown. And, yeah, like, David his pecs, yeah, and his pecs open weirdly, and then he ends up just getting fried at the end of the movie. Then General White, yeah, that old babon with the gray mustache. But I have no idea where he went. They may have said you went somewhere I dark. I fucking can't believe this. <laughs> He's in Twilight Town now. Moving right along, we found the good thing. Oh, so, I'm so tempted to look up whether we can just go straight to him and not care. Turns out he's in Far Outpost and he's just like... Yeah, he was hiding from us this entire time. What's the easiest way to get back? I think this way. I think. Yeah. Yeah! Yeah, because that one doesn't need a, a big pipe for it. Oh, I am actually so smart. Yeah! I almost broke my hand. Ah! How do I get up, though? Ah! This is all his fault! One of my friends texted me at, uh, at, like, 5 a.m. 5 a.m.? Or no, he texted me at, at, no, at midnight last night, and, uh, asking for, like, uh, he just asked me to pick, like, between, like, a number one and four, and, um, mm -hmm. and so I, I picked my, my number at 5 a.m., because I woke up at, at five. Yeah. Uh, and... Uh, and so I just sent him my number, and then he responded instantly, and I was like, I was like, why are you up at 5 a.m.? And he was like, I could ask you the same thing, and I was like, alright, we'll reconvene at a later point. Yeah. That is a good point. How do I get back up? Oh my god, do I have to go use the pipe to get back? Okay. <laughs> I see I no longer interest you as a person. Is it because I kept playing the Muppets? Maybe. <laughs> that is not a good reason. Alright, Twilight Town! Will it reject me because I have- I'm, I'm Luigi right now? I didn't. That'd be kind of funny. Excuse me, sir, have you seen a bomb? Oh, you, you, uh, you're Mario, they're a hero. Oh, Mario. <laughs> you're not gonna tell me information. You're not gonna tell me information. Come on, bitches, I need to know if you guys seen a bomb bomb around here. What about the mayor? That's a good point. Try the mayor. I was trying to think of people outside. We haven't really had to go inside to talk to someone about Thermal White. Yeah, I think it's someone outside, like, walking around. I mean, the only instance is, like, the tree, because you have to go inside it, because no one stands outside the tree. What about you? What, what about this guy? He looks like he's seen some shit. Oh, oink, oink, oink. What about this guy? Oh my god! Th does anyone know where this man is? Did I miss someone? Where's the bomb? Oh, this is the item shop. Shit. Okay, you guys seem happy. Uh, I guess in one of these houses someone knows something. 
Well, that house is empty. Come on, Yoshi. What is okay, it? It says. Uh, about to eat? The Twilighter in front of the inn at Twilight Town. What are you doing? Unless they spit through the text too fast. I think it means that one. Yeah. I thought this guy. What? <laughs> Wait, that general white? Yeah, I know that the guy. He's a wipe a bomb, right? He lived here until recently. What? Where'd he go? What am I, a secretary? He looks tired. I know that. Oh shit. Wait, is he in the inn? Well, shit, if, if no one knows where he went last, we don't. That's not really a clue to anything. Maybe we should just go back and be like, we found the gold guy, but like, we don't know where General White is. We ran out of clues. Because we, we looked around Poshley Heights. He's not in Poshley Heights, because we would have seen him. And I feel like the gold guy had been like... It's, it's one of my old co-workers. I know where he is. And I'm pissed off. <laughs> and that juju on the beat. <laughs> Dodging his shit left and right. Yeah, you definitely were. Good job. That's it, I'm killing myself. Don't do that. I heard that's bad for your health. God. Come on, bitch! Take my coins! Alright, I guess we'll just talk to them. Oh shit, I got an email. Gear? Yeah, yeah, gear. Yo, it's the rock! <laughs> Is this the so-called Great Gonzales? Uh, well, it's time for me, your worst nightmare. The new and improved rock cop. Don't think I forgot you, punk. I'm reborn, you coward. My training regimen would blow your mind. I'm on the fast track back to the top, and ain't nobody gonna get in my way. Rock! And still on rainy days, I feel the bruises your hammer of shame left on this bod. And I feel the rage again. If you ever show your face in the ring again, I'll beat you so bad your mama won't even recognize you. Remember the rock! Rock! Oh, give me goobers! Give me, give me, give me, give me! I love the goober song. Fine. What? You cannot find General White? Hmm. <laughs> oh, where did he go? That makes trouble for us. We definitely need him. Otherwise, we cannot even operate the thing. So, what do- what to do? I'm gonna fucking murder him. <laughs> That's why I said, imagine he's in- <laughs> I was trying to make it so you wouldn't look it up. That way you would have been pissed off during it, but... Well, I, I said, I said, uh, at the beginning, I was like, I bet you he's in fucking... in there, and then when I looked it up for the, that Twilight person, um, uh, I saw that he was back in, in the town. He seems to be asleep. Wake him up. <laughs> he's still asleep. Try again. He's still sound asleep. Try again. I feel like you want to do this. He's definitely still asleep. Oh. Yeah, remember the AMB or He's asleep, try again. He's still asleep, try again. He's still asleep. He's definitely still asleep. He's still sawing slugs. He can't be more asleep. He's counting sheep. He's awake, now he's still asleep. <laughs> he's sleeping like a stash baby. He's not even budging. He's still snoring away. Ugh, snork, snork. Now, who are you? I am tired. I do not need your attention. I just want to sleep. As it all is hopeless. Hut. That mustache. That hat. That hammer, even. Hut, hut. You've been looking everywhere, have you? I've been looking everywhere, have you? What? Why? Well, to bring back the cannon alive. I had lost my life work, my very reason for life. I found myself at wit's end, and then Rogue Poor Fortune Teller told me, 
Seek the man with the red M hat. The one with the hammer and stash. He will fulfill your dreams, or something like that. What? You need to use cannon to help you save the entire world? Hip hip hooray! That fortune teller was right! So, what are you waiting for? I'll get that cannon ready, and I'll go tell the mayor! So, get going! A tot! Yeah, so he's been looking everywhere for us this entire time, while we've been looking for him. I'm ready to bomb the moon! So, cannon back online? Well, I can just explode with the link. Now, let us shoot you guys to moon. Yeah, we did it, Gonzalez! Now you follow me. You come this way. You think we need to follow him? Well, let's go ahead and save. And then the next one, we'll shoot ourselves to the moon! We're blasting off again! Woo! Yeah. <laughs> well, thank you guys for joining! Hope you guys can do cool frustrate over the general white thing, but... <laughs> I'm all Yeah. You ain't that wonderful girl. <laughs> Alright, take care everyone. Bye-bye. Yep.